All right, imagine coming into school and you're walking down the hallway next to a six foot robot. Now that's just part of the day inside Rio Vista Elementary. <laughs> Joining us live is nine on your side, Sina Giuliano, who talked to the team that created this high tech friend. Very impressive. Good morning, Tina. Good morning. Yeah, the, the robot can do a whole host of different things. It looks like something out of a sci fi movie like like Star Wars, a, a C-3PO type of type of situation. Now the team behind uh, this robot is a group of fourth and fifth graders over at Rio Vista Elementary School. Jackspot, wake up. Meet the newest addition to Rio Vista Elementary. Let me stretch a little. Whoa, because he's super tall. He's six foot one it's, and I'm only four foot nine. His name is Jackspot. Jackspot, pose. And this life-size robot was created by the Rio Vista Robotics Club. He's named after like all our initials. Fifth grader Cora Jernigan says they've worked on Jackspot for the last six months. And so we spent a lot of time like wiring stuff and like solventing things together. Her club mate Cassie Sennett says they even got to use some high level technology. So we use 3D printing. We use 3D plastic with the printer. They learned how to program the robot to do different things like hold a ball or strike a pose. He says, hello, my name is Jackspot. He lists the creators and then he waves like this. Rio Vista's principal, Diana Kuhn, says this project is one of a kind. Well, the special thing is, is that no kids this young have ever built uh, a robot like Jackspot. The students are the first to build this design, which is from an inventor in France. We got all that information and, and thought, I think we can get fourth and fifth graders to build this. Club members like Jaden Morillo says it was difficult at first. Because I didn't think I could do it. But Senate says it was worth it. So, some parts are kind of hard to do, but others were just fun to do. Now, if you take a look here at my little take home gift, it is uh, a 3D printed version of Jackspot. Now, this is just one of the ways that they're using their high level technology to share it with their community and even the other kids in their classrooms. They hope to not stop here and keep working on uh, making those legs move and continuing to program it. Sending it over back to you, Lydia and Jose.